Welcome to the stream, everybody. Happy Friday. I am Iggy Kid. We are going to be playing some Pokemon Legends Arceus today, as has been the case for the last few weeks. Uh, my hope, there's a game that I just, uh, uh, that was just announced in the indie world. In fact, I can show you guys real quick. This game, Card Shark. I have the demo. I pre-ordered it. It's only like $17 right now. It'll be 20 at full price, but, uh, I'm so, so excited for this game. So my hope is to finish up the story of Arceus before it comes out. Beginning of June is the estimated thing. I don't, I haven't heard any official things or seen a trailer specifically, but according to my pre-order, it said June 2nd. So hopefully we can finish Arceus by then. But in the meantime, we're gonna warm up with some Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I played a little bit of this casually with family. Um, between streams, that was fun. Uh, yeah. So all we gotta do now, we're down to the final DLC cup for 150 CC, and then we can start getting into the mirrored cup. So lucky cat cup, here we go. I think I I think we can get it. Also, I feel a little foolish. My uh, my golf stream. I was doing that golf commentator voice, but I guess my mic positioning was off, and the music was much louder than I expected. So uh. Kind of hard to hear me for most of that, but I, I got decent views on it, so I don't know. Well, I'll have to remember that for next time, though. I got to keep a closer eye on the actual, like, levels. Because what I hear is not necessarily how you guys are going to hear it. Alright, here we go. Yeah, this is one where there's, like, one tricky one. I think it's, like, the last one gives me a little trouble. Yeah, right, right, right. The Ninja Hideaway. I get some trouble with that one because there's a lot of... A lot of spots where you can get caught up on corners and things. Oh, I should have saved it. Oh, maybe not. Looks like somebody else took the fall on that one for me. Appreciate it. Yeah, maybe I'll be able to get this in one. I don't want to get my hopes up too much. You know, it's been a long week, so I'm feeling a little, a little drained. But we'll get at least a couple, a couple hours of Arceus in. A lot of it's gonna be grinding. I might start grinding off stream, which is uh, what Coco recommended because, yeah, it's, it's just, there's a lot of game. It's only like a 25 hour game, but I've already spent some time doing some side stuff and things. So need to need to focus, not dilly dally so much if I wanna get it finished in a reasonable amount of time. So look forward to that. I don't know, maybe y'all like the grinding more. Let me know. Whichever you like, um, I will accommodate as best I can. I'm here to entertain y'all, so, you know, any feedback is appreciated. I'm always looking to make this the best stream that I possibly can. Put a lot of work into setting everything up, making sure it's all, you know, nice, visually and everything. Whoop, ah! That bloody lightning bolt took out my boombox. Drop behind just enough. Ah, oh, dip. Somebody hit me with the green shell. Oh, I think we're really close to the end, too. Yep. That sucks. Yep, yep, yep. Man, that's annoying. Right at the end. Okay, well, whatever. It happens. That's half the thing with Mario Kart, really. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's quit. Quit out and give that another shot. All right. And the usual loadout. I haven't gotten any new items. I think I might have just gotten all of them at this point. I don't know. I don't know how you would check, really. No, oh, it's a little, a little stuttery there. It says, yeah, it says there's no dropped frames, but you know, rendering. In terms of rendering, it's always gonna be a little wonky with this computer. I'm still saving up for that other computer, but you know. Bills, bills, bills. Got a got a trip coming up in July that I'm gonna go. See my family one more time before Christmas. Do some camping in the northwest. Haven't been camping in like ever. So I'm super excited for that. 
Um. Yeah. Ah, damn. Not a great start, but ain't too big a problem. Ah, uh, banana. Banana. Oh, get a metal Mario. Mm, take that. Come on. Come on, man. I also gotta get a new chair. This one, like, it's been falling apart for a while. My cat's, like, wrecked the heck out of it. This claws and, like, the stuffing all along the, like, lower back lumbar area is, like, terrible, terrible. It's, like, all the padding has just disintegrated at this point, so I just feel like a... It feels like a bar just jammed in my back, you know? So I gotta, gotta get a new chair. I'm gonna get... Not, like, the DX Racer. Cause I don't... I think they look really dumb frankly, um, but uh, one that's somewhat similar, it's somewhere between that and like an actual office chair, which is my preference. I just want one that's like tall enough that I can like actually put my head back. Whoa, what was that? Oh, what is going on? Oh, I like took, ow, it grabbed my controls and like jerked them to the wrong side. That drift should have been perfect, but it like jammed me to the wrong direction. <sighs> Come on, another try, another try. All right, all right. A lucky cat cup. Give it another shot. Attempt number three. It's interesting. They try and make cities look different, but like, you know, in the real world, like, most cities look pretty similar. Like, I, I'll have people try and tell me, like, oh, man, New York is so different from Seattle, it's so different from Arizona. It's like, I guess the weather, but, like, I've been to all of those places. And, like, they might have a slightly different vibe to them. But for the most part, it's like, they still just feel like cities. A lot of modern architecture is the same kind of stuff. Like, yeah. Tokyo would have a different skyline and it would have, you know, different religious uh, buildings and stuff, but a lot of it is going to just look like a modern city. That's why when I go to Japan, I'm not really as interested in going to, like, Akibara or, like, like, Tokyo in general, I'm not super interested in because I've seen it a million times in movies and stuff. It's fine, whatever. What I want to see is, like, the rural side of Japan. I want to go to the temples. I want to go to the hot springs. I want to check out, um... I want to check out the camping scene. Some camping on, like, Mount Fuji or whatever. That would be fun. You know, a lot of mosquitoes, but that's, that's camping. That's half of the half of the appeal, kinda. Can I please, can I please just get in first? Oh my god. This track is so annoying. They're like right on your tail the whole time. There we go. I don't know why this first one gave me so much more trouble. Alright, there we go. Next race! The Shroom Ridge. Shroom Ridge did not give me too much trouble the last few times. Um, 
think it was like Skyway or something. Uh, right. I think it's one of the Game Boy Advance ones after this. I don't know. I gotta play that Game Boy Advance. Like that will be probably be my warm-up game after I finish up Mario Kart 8. But like I've been working on this for like years at this point. I'll make it. I'll make it through eventually. You know. Hopefully I'll finish up the 150ccs today. Ah, uh, dip. Um. But yeah, the the 200. I have no idea how that's gonna go. Probably have to adjust my loadout. Go for something a little more balanced. Uh, yeah, probably a little lighter, a little more acceleration. Still with a decent top speed. I'm still gonna have top speed being my biggest stat. I'm just gonna pull it back in favor of some acceleration. Because my problem is always um, when I try and do a more acceleration based based uh, ah, build, uh, it never feels like it quite goes fast enough, you know? I always feel like I'm lagging behind regardless of how well I'm doing. But yeah, having this has a much nicer top speed. Keeps me, keeps me going strong. All right. I also want to go back at some point and finish some of the games you know, maybe I'll try Jack 2 again. I think it's not a very good game, but I might be able to, uh, might be able to manage. Um, definitely Mario RPG at some point. I just got to go and grind, basically. Blech. Jack X. I, I'd certainly like to try and finish Jack X. It's a, it's just a pain. It's not a very good racing game. Like by Jack, Jack One, I actually enjoyed a great deal on a casual side. You know, like 100%ing it was obnoxious, but it was like, it may as well. It's a collectathon. Um, but overall, I feel like playing it casually, it would be super fun. Then uh, Jack 2 sucks. It's bad. It's, it's just a game that's like ridiculously hard for the sake of being ridiculously hard. The controls are terrible. Jack 3 is actually really good. I actually really enjoyed Jack 3. I think the final boss is real, real BS, but you know, what can you do? And then uh, yeah, Jack X is okay. I just, there's a lot of problems. I think mainly the story thing is what's the problem because the battles suck. The battle mode is awful. Um, yeah, just the way that the battle mode works, you're, you're just so far apart. By the time you finally get anywhere near, um, the other, other guys, it's already too late. And because of the HP system, instead of being like, I don't know, Mario Kart, where a hit is a hit, so that when you hit somebody, it's just good. Uh, instead, they have a system where it's like you're doing actual damage to them. And it basically means that you get kill stealed constantly. It's the most annoying system for a kart battler I've ever played. That's pretty much it. You just get kill stealed constantly. There's nothing you can do about it. Oh no 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 no! Oh no no no, Ludwig! Oh oh no! I got caught in the crossfires. No! No! Oh, it took me back! Come on, man. Yeah, 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 finish it up. <sighs> it's 
Seriously. There's just a thing I, I noticed playing this casually, too, is, like, it's so... so annoying to have to deal with items. Like, ever. Always. It's the worst. Alright, let's, let's bump up acceleration a little bit. Um, this, I don't think, is gonna matter as much in terms of that. That's way too huge of a trade -off. Whoa, that's, yeah, that's a ridiculous trade-off. That's my thing with the acceleration, is it's it's never a fair trade. So it's a huge, it's a huge drop in top speed and like a, a tiny boost in um, acceleration. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I do like him sitting in the the tiny blue falcon though. It's cute. Alright, let's see how this loadout works. Okay, okay. I'll throw that back. I'm liking it so far. I, I was able to come up to speed a lot faster, but it yeah, that's the big thing, is I'm not going to be able to go overall very fast. <sighs> yeah, I can see Baby Peach right on my tail. It's just... Or no, that's not Baby Peach, that's uh, Koopa. Ooh, nice try. Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah, you butternut squash. Stop! Oh, that's the most annoying thing in the world. When you go by someone while you're mostly stopped and then they throw something back at you. T -t -t Stop! It's the most vindictive, annoying crap in the world. I hate it. Whoops. Oh no, my boombox! Get out of here, Koopa. It's really, it's the items. I understand it's a balancing thing. So then, you know, no matter how far ahead you get, you know, in most cases, the people behind can do something about it, but it's also, like, uh, annoying, and I don't like it. Stop. Are you kidding? Ah! Dude, I was right there! That's the thing that really upsets me, is when I'm like right there and then I get... Or like most of the race, I'll be in first place and then right at the end, oh, nope, never mind. Nope, none for you. Hold on, I messed up. I wish it let you pause during the countdown. Frustration. All right, we're gonna adjust this again. Yeah, fine. We'll we'll go with this. See how it works out. I just yeah, I, I don't know. I like the top speed ones a lot because like you actually go really fast. My goal is generally to just get away from the mob of friggin' jerks. Then it ends up not mattering anyways. Get out of here, Ludwig. Who's, who says that Ludwig's their favorite Koopaling? Really, ever. Like, is that ever? Is that, he's nobody's favorite, you know? Is 
There we go. All right. I'll just toss that back. Cause a little havoc. So you hit Koopa. As far as I can tell. Go get some gold. All right, now I am safe from the blue shells. Well, I would have been safe from the blue shells, but uh, red is just as obnoxious, really. Oh, and there's another one. Mm. Yep. Stop giving me the coins. I hate. The coins, they're so useless to me. So I've already unlocked all this stuff. Ah! Lightning! Oh, there we go. Getting ahead. I need to get ahead by too much. There we go. Just release some stuff. Conk! Right into the sign. Works for me. All right. Next race, Shroom Ridge. Here we go. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ooh, I'm uh, able to maneuver a little more delicately. I do like that. Yeah, with the other car, I was always kind of having difficulty making the really tight adjustments. Uh, at speed. This is this is going pretty good. Get rid of that coin. Ah, what was that? Where'd that come from? I guess they don't uh, they don't warn you unless it's a red shell. Get him, get him. Come on. Okay, okay. There we go. Okay. Finally in the position I should be in. Come on, man. Ah, dip! It's so obnoxious when you're in a drift and you get a red shell warning because, like, it's not gonna, you can't stop it, really. Because it's you're gonna release the sh whatever item at the wrong angle. Oh, it takes me, I think, less time to build up a drift as well. That's pretty good. Okay. Sky Garden. This one's pretty short. Then we can deal with the ninja hideaway. Ba bam. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. Now we get around. Nope. That's okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, I thought you were so clever there, eh, Koopa? Not on my watch. Not on my watch! Not appreciated, thank you. What? How did that green shell not hit that red shell? It's absurd. Let's see. Let's see. Come on now. Whoop. Barely made it over. Okay. Got to get better framework for uh, when the different spark levels happen. Oh no, blue shell, wait until I land. Okay, I still got a full lap to catch back up. Nope, come on, move it, move it. Ah, oh, you, blue pig. Oh good, yeah get him. Get him, uh, what was that, Waluigi? Oh, that was Metal Mario. Maybe that was Inkling Boy. Frick! Ah, oh, no! Squeaked right out of there. Oh, uh oh, oh no, oh no. No, Inkling, no! No, I can't catch up. I can't do the boost. Oh, wait, nope. Second. Great. It's fine. All right, all right. I think we're doing pretty okay with this loadout. I just gotta. Gotta keep learning. It's tricky. Here we go. All right. Pretty good start. Crafting off you. Crafting. Scooly do 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 scooty do do do. Ah! Oh, I didn't see that in time. That was my bad. Oh, come on! He shot it so close that I didn't even have a chance to react. Get out of my face. Get out of my face, Ludwig. Come on, dude! No, I'm just restarting. I'm not entering lap three in seventh. Here we go. Oh, they put Mario Kart as one word in this load screen. Never actually noticed that. Hmm. Pretty sure it says Mario, uh, no, actually even there. It's one word, huh. Weird. I don't think, I'm pretty sure it's separate words on the cover and stuff, isn't it? I don't know. I don't have the cover here. Because I made this game digitally. 
Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. Here we go. Nope. Oh, boy. Oh, get him on the ricochet? No. I dodged around. It's Sit right by. Save this for like red shells. It's not gonna. Nothing I can do if there's any blue shells, but you know, that's just how it is. Being in first. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right, there we go. <laughs> Moving on. Shroom Ridge doesn't give me any trouble. I like how it's a totally different color for the blast because it's the the blue falcon. Ah, dude. Maybe Luigi. That's who's giving me trouble this time. Okay. All right. You do your boost. I don't even care. Whoa, whoa. Oh, jeez. Ah, I let go. Alright. Make a little room. Hopefully, take these guys off my case. But who knows? Maybe it'll work out. Maybe it'll just be more nonsense. All right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, uh, uh. No! Okay, fine. It's, you know what? It's fine. Lightning means that everybody got screwed over, so. I don't even care. Ooh. Scooch around you. Back this way. No more of that. I'm gonna scoop around. Get purple here. Real lucky. Nope. Cannot see. Squid does not worry me so much most times, but uh, yeah, sometimes it can be a big problem. Come on, <laughs> who decided to do a lightning bolt when there was one still active? That is so ludicrous. And I ain't talking Andre 3000. He was an outcast, but I always get those two mixed up for some reason. It's something about Ludacris and Outcast. The names of those, for some reason, my brain just seems to think that they're they're interchangeable. Which is incorrect. There we go. And just a start. Don't let them draft off me as much as you can. 
deny them that. Zip around here. So many paracoupas. Just a float. Just a float. There we go. I wonder, I wonder how much say Shigeru Miyamoto has in uh, the, the, the like 3D models of some of these characters. You know? Because like he drew and designed like Mario in them. So I'm just curious if he gets like if he gets the uh, the option to be like, oh yeah, we gotta lift this a little bit there. Like, just look at it and let him know how things are. All right, that's fine. There's a boost right here. Getting pretty close though. I think I've read one of these bananas so I can maybe get a better item. Nope, 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 nope. Get rid of this trash, man. Banana's kind of okay as a defensive thing, but like, there's a million better items I could be looking for. And where are we at? Oh, how did I not flip? Eh, whatever. There we go. Third one down. Now we just need to get the ninja hideout. Ninja hideaway, whichever, whatever it's called. It's got a lot of tight turns, but <sighs> fingers crossed, you know? F fingers crossed. All right, there we go. I'm just gonna take it as, as straightforward as I can, you know? I'm not gonna try anything fancy. I'm just gonna zip through as tight and clean as I can. Alright, and then we. Yep, timing on that can be a little funky, but I got it. Ooh, don't hit the pillars. This part kind of... Ah, oh, this part gives me trouble. That's the part where I'm not totally sure how to handle it. Whoa, that's not what I wanted to do. Crap. Ah, what was that? Oh, boost is cool, I guess, but like that threw me off because I wasn't expecting a boost. All right, let's keep moving. That's, oh, no, nope, can't get up top. Okay. Let's just take the, the bottom path. It's a little easier to navigate. Keep missing the jumps. I don't know why that keeps happening. Oh, I was in first for a second. Now I'm in second for longer. Yeah. There we go, there we go. Watch out for the shy guys. How shy really are these guys? Has anyone asked? They seem pretty confident to me. Hello? No, ah! We were all clustered right at the front anyways, it didn't matter. Not making it. That's what I'm saying, man. When I don't have the full top speed as high as I can go, then it's like. It always feels like there's no way to catch up. 
It always feels like there's just that little bit that you can't do. Yeah, we're going back. We're going back to my old loadout. I didn't even get the two star on that one. Come on. Come on. Oh well. All right, let's yeah, let's go back to our old loadout. Hold on, let's we'll do this and then we'll check the wheels. Try these wood wheels, maybe. Well, let's actually check. Probably that. Uh, slick. Now yeah, let's go with the slick wheels. See how that works for us. to start things off. See, yeah, already I feel way better going so much faster. It's like the acceleration is nice sometimes, but frankly, I'm just as likely to fall behind if I get hit. Um, and this way I feel like I can actually catch up eventually, whereas with the... The acceleration one, I felt like I would always be, always be playing catch up. I don't like that. I prefer playing must. Actually, more of a stone ground than a plane. Nope, no thanks. Not bad. Whoa. What was that? Hold on. I, like, destroyed the, uh... I, like, destroyed the banana. It just, like, disappeared. Weird. Stop it! Oh, stop! This is why you turn items off in a serious match. I don't know, do you? It's probably a good idea. Whoa, almost hit myself. The bomb. Oh, oh, oh. oh, 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 hit her, hit her. No, or no, that was drive point. Whatever, man. <laughs> that blue shell takes its time. Okay. All right. Let's go. Run. Run. Drive. Ah, whatever. Y'all know that. 
Can we go flying over? There's secrets in this track I do not even know about. Played it a few times, but I guess it could be stuff that I haven't seen. Similar to how I played Ribbon Road so many times, I never realized that there was like a little side path until I saw one of the NPCs go down it. Nice try. Not today. I can smell my roommate's dinner. I ate dinner kind of early. Uh, to prep for this, so I might grab a snack. But I'm starting to feel hungry again already. I've been trying to just eat more often and less large meals. It's supposed to be better for you. And overall, it like, you know, I am still eating like a lot more because I'm trying to gain weight, gain muscle. I do hit the gym tomorrow. I get up early to hit the gym too. Well, early for me. Seven o'clock is not really that early. There we go. I want to go early so that when I leave, I can get the Taco Bell breakfast. Because they give, if you get at least $5 a Taco Bell breakfast, you get a free Cinnabon copy. Not sponsored or anything, you know, I just uh, think about Taco Bell a lot. Whoa! Alright. My big thing with Taco Bell is that it's like, it's a healthier fast food. It's still like a lot of salt, for sure. But, uh, you know, I don't get like the beef or anything. Their ground beef is pretty gross, so I'm just like, I don't even want that. Um, so just always sub it for like beans or chicken and it's like, yeah, it ends up being fine. You know, it's mostly like rice, beans, and vegetables. I had an ex who was like always so mad when I would say that too. Because I'd always be like, yeah, we'll get Taco Bell. It's just like rice, beans, and vegetables. It's not that bad. And she was all obsessed about like carbs and fat and she always wanted to go vegan for like the worst reasons. Um, just vanity, just pure vanity. And uh, yeah, it'd be like, stop saying that. It's like, oh, it's not, it's correct. Like I'm not lying, I'm not wrong. Like it's just cheap Mexican food. Effective, I mean cheap Tex-Mex really. And I don't, I don't really get it with the cheese anymore either, so it's even like, uh, even less of a problem because that's just like a lot of cholesterol, really. But then again, cheese is also a lot of fat, and fat is good for your brain. We should let you have the coins that they get after you win. Feels more fair. All right, Sky Garden. Feeling much better about it. Had a lot less difficulty with the first couple of uh, tracks. Because now I can get up to a good speed. Get away from all the trials and tribulations of the 
the other races. It's fantastic. Just gonna, well, we're gonna clean out my inventory real quick. Hey, what the heck? How'd you get up there? King Boo is giving me trouble this time. Okay, okay. There's always like secret stuff you can do if you hit like a mushroom at the right point, but I'm always, I just want to get going as fast as I can. You know, I just want to drive. I don't want to hold back and do weird secret shortcuts. Like I'm just going to go faster. That's how I win. Whoops. It's all right. We're just going to wait until he's in the air and we're just going to Good for me, though. Oops, should not have drifted there. Wasn't able to build up enough. Make it worth it. Oh, whoa, whoa. There we go. Right at the end. Villagers coming up on me pretty quick. That's all right, because we're at the end of it. See a bullet bill coming. It's all good. All right, Ninja Hideaway. I feel pretty good about my chances. This is gonna be my last shot, and then I'm gonna go on break, and then we'll get into the main game of the evening, Pokemon Legends Arceus, but uh, yeah. I'm hoping that I can finish off the 150cc tonight. Yeah, we're gonna take. Whoa! Oh, what is this? Why did it turn me? It turned me so hard. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, oh. Okay, okay. Still, still lap two. I got time to make up for it. Yeah. Bad move. What are you taking me, like it to? Taking your sweet time there, pal. Oh, come on! How? I'm so heavy! How did he do that? Come on now. Yeah. You might be able to make it. It's still pretty early in the lap, but I'm not as stoked about my chances now. All right. All right. Let me get close to him. No! Oh, I maybe could have. Maybe could have. It's too late. It's much too late. Oh, do the flips or whatever, dude. Ugh. Whatever. I got closer that time.
<sighs> All right, well, gonna take a break. When we come back, it'll be Pokemon Legends Arceus, everybody. All right, so don't go anywhere. Don't touch that dial. We are back with more in just a minute.
All right. I am back. We're playing Arceus. So I am just going to be focusing on getting through the story. Because there's a lot of story to get through, as far as I can tell. We need to get Pokemon up into like the the high thirties, I think. Before we can really continue on. And so that might take a minute. Take him out. Oh yeah, that'll be no problem right there. I think it was a request to get a male and a female hippopotamus, but I don't care right now. I got other plans. Bite him! Chomp, 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 chomp. Bite. Brown sheep. Ooh. Sparkling dark tumblestone. Maybe I should have healed up. All right, we'll throw out Shellos. Uh, no, I said Shellos. There we go. I don't like how confirmation has to be different buttons in this system. Like, it's A to fight, but then it's like a, tr a right trigger to throw out the Pokemon. So, like, just, yeah, under different circumstances, you get different inputs. I don't like that. I don't like it very much at all. I think I think this this interface is pretty weak, frankly. So what can you really do? Nope. Oh, God damn it. She again is everything is super context sensitive in a way that's really obnoxious. Like I'm just trying to get into my inventory to uh get a different, or to get an item out, and it's giving me nonsense about it. Fight. Uh, we'll just use Gust. Save Air Cutter for the ones that really need it. Oh, okay. Wasting my time. Oh. What's that? What is that? And hello? Yeah, if you want to fight, I was going to fight you soon anyway, so... That works for me. I just... Take you out to the bowl game. Perfect. Chip away at him. Um, what is that done? Probably ground. I think Contra will be safe. Him with a hex. What? Crunch does that much? I guess crunch is dark. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, that's the other thing is the quick change one is annoying because I can't see what moves my guys have. 
out. Take him out, please. There we go. Gold bat can evolve. Sure is something taking on a big angry hippo don like that. Wait, what's that lying over there? My charm. It's really you. Welcome back. It means a lot to me that you went toe-to-toe -to -toe with that hippo don on my behalf. You better believe I won't be losing this charm again. Not if you went to all that trouble to get it back to me. I didn't realize that's what that was. I just saw some sparkly and I went for it. Okay. What was that? What hit me? Oh. It's a prime hippo don, eh? Hold on, relax. Let's just heal up my guys and then I'll I'll get you. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Hold on. No, I hit the wrong button. Okay. Yeah, I'll bet it did. Oh, I dropped a revive. Man. That was pretty obnoxious. I'm not even like under leveled for this area. That's the, that's the thing that's annoying about it is like I'm I should be plenty strong here, but ah, whatever. Thunder shot. Stop. Y'all can pretend like this is a more exciting, like this is more exciting than a regular Pokemon battle, but it is just another Pokemon battle. Same, same verse as the first. Just because I can run around and look at it at different angles doesn't really change that much. Oh, Gust is even stronger, actually. Should just be using that. Get him. Yeah, we're not leveling very fast. Let's uh let's take out this pro gunk. Air cutter, no good the guts. Yeah, see. And we're gonna Or no, we're gonna Feather I do I not have great balls? I only have the feather balls. Man, okay, that's fine. Right. Dust. Later. No, I dropped all my super potions. Aw, oh, man. Why does Pikachu have so little health? I feel like Pikachu should have more than 100 health, right? 30. 30. Uh... Level 31 or whatever. That's right, it's stunked. Oh, what the heck? Water ball is 
constantly like dripping all over me. I don't know what's wrong with this thing. Hey, yeah, come at me. I don't care. Can you guys tell how much I love grinding? Golly gee, it's the most fun to just stumble around slapping it slapping at enemies that are no challenge to me. It's just it's such useless gameplay. I don't eh. Like, why do this when instead you could easily just balance your game out so that by the time I get to a place, I am a high enough level to not be challenged the same way? Like, it'd be pretty simple to do that. You guys are doing playtesting and gathering data, right? You're designing a game? Probably, it'd probably be helpful if you did that. Rather than just assume. Like, oh, this is probably a good level. Nah. It wasn't a good level. Yeah, yeah, he's aggressive. Get him. Frankly, even the animations here are so much less appealing than they were in uh, in a lot of the 2D Pokemon games. Like, watching Ponyta stiffly just turn into a, a ring of fire is, like, is not half as interesting as um, seeing, like, a bunch of flames ribbon around the screen and then in a, a crazy like dervish roll roll back around to hit him in like, like a typhoon that's great that was fun this is just like I don't know it feels like they're just phoning it in man feels like they could be putting a lot more effort into this Problem is, I'm not even close to my goal. I'm already so bored with this. This gameplay. That I want to just go risk it. Let's, let's evolve our guys. Yeah, let's evolve Golbat as well. Oh my god, it's Crobat! It's Crobat. And let's let's change some moves around. Uh can get rid of Roost. Sure. And... We can get rid of Leafage. There we go. I, yes? No, oh, I gotta hit confirm first, okay. Yeah. Yeah, no, I get it. You don't need the pomp and circumstance like I'm forgetting moves. I hate double hit, let's get rid of it. Uh. Yeah, let's get rid of tackle. We don't need that. And I don't want double hit, so we're just gonna swap that out for hypnosis. Hunter. Got a single ghost move. Uh, 
Yeah, let's use Astonish over Hypnosis, I think. Pikachu. Spark does 65. Yeah, let's switch Spark over Thunderbolt. And we'll do this over Thunder Wave. Confirmed. Yes. And Cross Poison. 70 over 100. Yeah, let's do that instead of Hypnosis. All my flying types have like the same moves. I don't like that. Change your moves. Mud Bomb. It's probably better than Mud Slap, right? Yeah, let's let's do that over Mud Bomb. And we'll do this over Tackle. Confirmed. Good. All right, we're all set to go. Let's let's try this stuff out now. And with the magical leaf, no, don't waste of time. Nice. Just having different moves makes me a little less bored of this, so. That's good. Um, yeah, we need to go to an area with higher... Whoa, with uh, stronger Pokemon, I think. Uh, I don't get the Alpha. Get that Alpha Stunky. What is he, level 45? That's a lot. Yeah, that's not great for me. No, and nothing I have is very effective against it. Well, let's, let's give Gastrodon a shot. Squish. Scun tank. Oh yeah, they'll do it. Wow. Okay, survived. So that's fine because I'm just gonna use this one again. Plenty. Yup. Good guy. What's this crow gunk doing hanging around? Don't you dare. Oh my god. If they seriously kill my Gastrodon and rob it of the XP because of this stupid little crow gunk. Ember. Get burned. Get burned. Come on. Come on, mate. Let me just hit you. Let me just hit you with an ember. Nice. There we go. Seed of Mastery. Useful, for sure. Uh, but yeah, there, there it is. Give that to you. Uh, oh no, I'm out of potions. Cause I dropped my freaking bag. Just gotta wait and hope somebody else picks it up, even though I know where it was. Right over there. Whatever. I, I can't, yeah, I can't even see my own satchel. That's annoying. Well, let's swing back to camp over here. And heal up. Uh, 
Just a little while. Then item store. Did I leave any potions? Nope. Can I? You got anything to buy, perhaps? No, oh, we got craft. Just make a bunch of potions this way. Sure. Let's make some balls. Not a great balls would be well, great as you'd expect. Super potion. Get some of those. And why not some revives? Uh, don't need any of that stuff. All right, let's head back out. Well, there's a Badoo. How about you? Get got. Well, I'd certainly expect you to, but uh, you're dead. Like nothing. Uh, you know what? I think there's various stuff to grind in the new area, frankly. So let's let's just swing to the new area. And grind some stuff out out there. What's up, Leventon? How are you doing? Record my findings, sure. Pretty solid amount of uh, points there. Return to the village. Although, is there a way to just return straight to the uh, the other regions without going back to the village first? That'd be good. Yeah, I just wanna just wanna head back out to the Cobalt Coastlands. We're gonna grind her out there. <laughs> Who's weakest here? Well, looks like my Gastrodon. So yeah, Gastrodon will get a uh, get some training in. All right, Burmy. Oh, is that shiny, or is that just female? In either case, I'll catch you real quick. Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Yeah, hit it with the great ball. Nice. Bite me. Get ancient powered. Whoa. Get ancient powered. Yeah, these guys are more at a level where it's gonna gonna be able to crank up through the ranks pretty quick. Oh, let's hit him with the first Ooh, oh, just a little bit left. No, not Night Slash. Ah, heck, I'll, I'll catch you. Why not? Gonna probably have to eventually anyways, you know? Honked him around the dang head. Hey, don't do that. 
gonna get earth powered. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Um, who's next? Who's next out there? Get him. Spiel. Ancient power. Nice. Oh man. All right, all right. Get him. Get him. And oh, we'll catch. We'll catch him. Okay, ball. Pop pod. Sure. I think we need those for something. Somebody was asking, I don't know. Got him. Ready to take him out. Ancient power. Hit him with the ancient power. Go down. I know we leveled up for a minute, but I'm getting pretty decent XP. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh, almost. Almost one shotted. Ancient power. Dead. Oh boy, that guy looks intimidating. Uh, let's... Oh, see that guy over there? Let's head over here to grab that, uh... A little the wisp. I see that. How do I get up there? Is it Bethesda time? I think it might be. Hold on, let's... Let's get our guys. There we go. Oh. Come on, come on, I know you can do it. Eh, come on, come on. Right. Holy gone. Hmm. Maybe not from that side then. A little trickier to get up on this edge, but I think we'll be manageable. Just gotta find gotta find the one one little rough spot where we can get traction. Come on now, weird ear. You and me. You and me, man. We got this. <sighs> no. Can't get it this time. That's quite alright. Fight me. Fight me, Drifloon. Do your worst. I don't even care. Ancient power. Ancient power. Dead. Dead by my hand. 
There we go, leveling up. That's what I like to see. All right, and yeah, big boy. It's not, no, that's not Alpha. Griflin. Like a blimp. All right. Got him. Got it. Ancient power. Get him. Oh. Oh. What? Hey, 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 why'd you get a second hit? Let me hit you with the ancient power. Alright, let's let's heal up. And do I have any stuff for the, the power points? Uh, da, da, da. Not on me. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see what we can with Grastrodon, and then we can just switch over to somebody else. I see. Ancient power. Not the mystical fire. My gastrodon. All right. We done did it. Um, let's switch to Dartrix. Do we want Tartrix? Oh, Murkrow. Let's hit Murkrow up. I don't think I've caught a Murkrow yet either. The fool. Wasting that time. Let's just get the air slash. One hit. It's a one hit wonder. Feels good. Feels good. Yeah, let me get the flying type. Scruppy. Air slash. Took him out. No prob. Tangela. No, don't. Well, he's getting aggressive. We gotta put him out. What? Avoided? Will y'all hit each other, please? Jeez Louise, just having a turn of just like, he tried it, he dodged, he tried it, didn't do anything, like, they do something. You weenies. Get over here, get over here. Fight me. Mothm. Whoa! Okay. We'll get you back for it. You're gonna be like that. Jeez. So mean. I cannot condone such ridiculousness. <laughs> Air slash. One shot. One shot. That's right. 
Get into trash. Man. Digging out some juicy bits. Some plump beans. Some plump beans. Hey, a slash. Come on. Air slash. Yeah. Yeah. Boy, I almost want to take him on. I think I can manage. Let's take out this Skaroopy. Well, it's coming for me anyways. Let's do it. Drapion. Don't kill my man. Oh, okay. Stats move. Gonna hit you with an aerial ace. Not terrible, not terrible. Not hyper beam. Ooh. Yeah, I severely underestimated this guy. I thought, isn't your bug type? It looks like a bug. Looks like it's Gastrodon once more. Earth power. Ooh, ooh, almost. No, don't do it. No, don't do it. Oh. Uh, just need something effective, I guess. Yeah. Let's use, like, spark. Right, er, I could use thunderbolt. Yeah, that's enough. Nice. Hold on, pal. Gotta fix my kids. They hurting. There we go. There we go. Get him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Show off all you want, bud. Let's heal him back up. All right, I've been up all night in game. Just slapping bugs. And yeah, we'll go with Aerial Ace. Ooh, still one hit. Nice, nice. Yeah, sorry if the commentary is a little repetitive. I just, uh, well, the gameplay is real repetitive. I don't have much new to say at a certain point, because, uh, I'm slapping bugs. Just slapping dang bugs. I think, I think we should be good to move to the next area before too long. Because they're only up in the 40s there, I think. And so while we'll be a little underleveled, 
won't be by my I'll, I'll you know what I'll go until until the next break and then however far I'm at that's what uh that's what we'll work with for the the second hour of the main event here hope you all ready for it because it's calm It's a beautifly. It's so beautifly. And it's going to die by my hand. Happy. Knock it off. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Nice. Ah, uh, no room for that. All right. Stop it. Right, we will go until, well, yeah, until the break. Um, hopefully, Gastrodon will get over level 35. That's my, that's, that would be ideal. But even if not, it should be okay. Stop. You're hitting my little theater kid. He needs to be in death of a salesman. You're going to hurt his little ass. And he won't look very good as Willy Loman. Not really. I don't know. Is Willy Loman is supposed to be attractive. Never seen Death of a Salesman. Never read it. Don't really know that much about it, aside from like the obvious stuff. That you hear through the grapevine or whatever. Dartrix can evolve. I think I'll probably finish off this chunk by doing that. But right now I want to focus on getting these this grind done. And with the aerial ace. Later. Isha Volpix. I'm gonna kill it. Wait. Right. It's Gastrodon. Look, it's a little baby. It's about to die. Or not, I guess. Okay. Sure. Mm, yep, you. Hey, Stantler. Stant it up, baby, with your lumpy head. Stantler is quite the lumpy fella. What can you do about it, you know? Sometimes life deals you a lumpy head. Just gotta deal with it. Dude, I hate that. Just means you wasted all of your time. Any any PowerPoints you used are wasted. Get back here and fight me, coward! Oh, never mind. 
Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to switch over to Dare Tricks. And crush a mushroom bug right down. Aerial Ace. Easy bug type. So we squat easy. Two. Take him out. Take him out. Youch. Oh right, flying. Flying is not so good against electric. No, 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 no. Hey, stop it. Power. Crunch him down. Get corked on. Get friggin' brunked. Um, I think this guy has flying moves. Oh, oh. Hit him. There we go. Ooh. Leaves got in the way and made it kind of switch out for a second. Cross poison. Yes, dead. Oh, we're getting pretty close to that 35. Yeah, I'll be able to get it before before I go on break. Nice, nice. Oh, that's weird. It's showing me the, um, the waypoint over there, but it's just because it's on the other tip of this moon-shaped area. Air cutter. I done did it. Ooh. Very close, very close. Let's get one more Mothim. I think that'll do it. Yeah, come on now. Dead. There we go. All right, and yeah, we'll we'll do some grinding on our way back down here. And let's evolve Dartrix. Let's do it. It's Hisuian Decidueye. I didn't know they had a Hisuian form. Whoa, that's cool. Rock Smash. Oh, he's like grass fighting? Weird, okay. Fighting type would be useful. Um. Let's see, I'll switch it out for Gust. Yeah. Triple arrows. Sounds cool, but not gonna not gonna do that yet. Yeah. Um Let's, yeah, let's keep going with Crobat for right now. There we go. And we'll just, we'll just keep grinding. Feels mean to just run away before they even, they even are actually finished, but you know what, I ain't got time. I'm a busy kid. I gotta do a whole survey or whatever. Stop it. There we go. That's what you get. That's what you get. 
some fly balls I'm pretty sure let me some feather balls can I get that guy it's a little far away get closer get closer oh they go real far okay oh almost oh oh a little higher up I think they actually have some gravity situation. I think that might be it. Ah, no. Nope. Get him. Go get him. Ooh. Oh, that looked like a hit. Oh. Oh, that just bonked him, though. Which means it's probably not working. Man, that sucks. Ah. I haven't got any space for it. Starly, what are you doing here? What are you doing here ripe for the, for the whacking? Yep, yep, yep. Get him. Hey. Get him. And what'd you get? I think you should get him. Let's hit a feel with the crowbat right now. Just a heckin' little guy. Oh. Just a heckin' little guy. Get him. Didn't die? Weird. There we go. <coughs> there he is. Oh. Okay. Sin with Gus, why not? Heck, let's end with cross poison. Nice. And let's just swing back up this way. <coughs> Excuse me. Take out some glam meows on our way. Then we'll take a break. Don't you run from me out oh, here. It's gonna do the cross poison. Eh, it didn't matter. And one last one. Ah! Okay, I guess not. Fine, fine, fine. Whatever. I don't even care. 
All right, let's empty our inventory of all the stuff we don't need. Yep, yep, yep. my controller cable moving on my leg and as I moved back a little bit I felt it move up so I thought it was like a bug crawling up my leg oh that spooked me I'm good I'm good all right now let's heal up <clears throat> I could use a rest just a little while all right and with that, I'm going to take a break, so don't go anywhere, don't touch the internet dial, I'll be our back with more Pokemon Legends Arceus in just a minute. Okay, okay.
All right, we are back. I'm gonna go for probably another hour or so, and then for uh, quite a bit longer tomorrow, since that is more my main streaming day is Saturday. But uh, yeah, well, here we go. I'm gonna go do some of the story. Hopefully I can remember the voices I gave to these uh, newer characters. Uh, yeah. yeah. Ooh, a Will the Wisp. Let's go get that real quick. It's right there. It's right there. I will just scoot on down. And here we go! To the spooky hand. Sp spooky, spooky town. Population, scary. Resident Evil. You know? The residents, they've gone evil. What can we do? I can't do anything about it. Well, you think you can do something about it? Sup? Sup, Driplim? We're just, we're just gonna skirt on by this whole situation. I guess this was also always an option, but I just didn't want to get too far behind, you know? Because there are the story battles you gotta do. That's a thumb. And there's a bunch of those little guys. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure I actually have to fight a Dusclops. That, that was part of this. Hold on. Hold on, let me check the the requests. Yeah, I need to find a Dusclops for Iskan. Where are them boys at? Oh, there's one. Hey, bud. Can I help you? Yeah, she's like level 40, but I can manage. Don't kill, don't kill. Yeah, that's good. Ooh, ooh. And then we're just gonna swing a great ball out there. Ah, I'm gonna have to give it another shot. Good thing I got 50 great balls. Yeah. Here we go. Obtained. And then also we're gonna go talk to Gully. to set up a camp. Hello? Oh, you're here. I've been waiting. Like I said, I need your help finding Yorick from the construction core. He and I came out here to set up a base camp, but then he went off on his own to get the lay of the land and hasn't come back. Yorick ought to still be somewhere nearby. If you find him, please tell him to come back here already. Is he just gonna be a skull? Is that, is that the joke here? Cause he's Yorick. Uh, sure. Uh, what's that box? Hello? What's that crate? Scatterbang. Whoa, there's some good stuff in there. Hot dog. I'll keep an eye out for York, I suppose, but... Now I'm on the lookout for these crates. Alright. Get out of the way. I'm not even interested in you. I've got a million other things on my mind. Like, uh, pop pods. A bunch of pop pods. You know. Who the heck are you? 
Treasure chest. Oh, an Ultra Ball. Nice. That should come in handy. You said that. Wish you could jump. I feel like that was one of the things Breath of the Wild recognized is that you, if you're gonna have a big open world, you gotta let people jump. You know? Just a quick little jump. Just a quick little hop and a half. Ain't even gotta be a huge jump, you know? Um, where am I headed now? Eh, uh, this one, this, sure, sure, we'll go this way. I don't need you. I don't need your sass. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Over there. Boy, I sure hope I can remember his scan's voice. That was a long time ago. Like, uh, almost a week. Long enough for me! Watch out, Rabombi. I don't want to have to hurt you, but if I gotta, I'll do what has to be done. Dazzling honey. All right, we're headed up. Hello. Did you bring it? You know, the Pokemon with a name that sounds like, um, the Dust Bops. Yeah. Here you go. You really brought it? No, don't bring it out. Right. I guess, I guess I've got to do my part, seeing how, um, determined you are to go to that island with Basque Legion. Usually I, uh, ask Polina if the growler she takes care of can help me with this bit. But this time, you need to help. Uh, since, well, since we're making this snack so that you'll be accepted by Basque Legion. Once I give the signal, you have that dust bop of yours use its dark pulse. Okay. Three. Two. What? No, it's too frightening. Could you get a grip? Right, so counting down to it just makes the anticipation tear worse. Let's simply have you do it when I say go. And go! Did that do it? A delicious aroma wafts through the air. Basque Legion's favorite snack is now ready. You obtained a ball of Basque Legion food. A favorite food of Basque Legion. A Pokemon that will bear you on its Basque Legion. This food is crafted in a Basque Legion way from ingredients gathered via Basque Legion methods. Both the aroma and the shape are perfect. It's the perfect ball of Basque Legion food. Then let's make for Ginkgo Landing. We can summon Basque Legion there. Sure. Where's that? Over there. Let's go. Uh, excuse me. Let's go. If in you don't mind. Whoa. Excuse me. I am, I am just running. Oh, okay, I can't actually go around this way. Sure, why is the camera doing that? Stop! 
Hey, camera, point so that I can see where I'm going. Why, Why would it ever default to a direction where I can't see where I'm going? Ridiculous. I guess it looked kind of cinematic, but like, it's less cinematic when you're crashing into everything, you know? That's Gully. Sorry, I just figured you'd automatically change this to the one I'm actually trying to go to. Yeah, so I ran all the way out there for nothing. Cool. Actually, let's... Yeah, let's fast travel. Why well, waste our time? Yeah, there we go. We'll just weird deer our way down. Right over cha. Hello. Rolling. Oh, hello Iggy. I I was just waiting for you. Hello, Scan. Oh wait, no, it's it's her, right? Oh, Polina, I thought you said we shouldn't be seen together. I'm sure Iggy can keep a secret. Besides, both I and the Growlithe pups were eager to meet with the great Basque Legion again. I see. Well, in that case, let me summon Basque Legion. Do it. Yeah, same sound as every time. Got it. You guys couldn't come up with a another tune? Just one? Hey. Draw. Go on, Iggy. You can give the food to Basque Legion now. You do it. He threw in the ball of Basque Legion food. Oh. Draw. The great Basque Legion. Oh, thank goodness. I was a little worried about whether Basque Legion would accept this favor. So, uh, Iggy, you should let Basque Legion hear you're playing. Make the sound. Yeah. Yeah, do it a third time, why not? Okay. Basque Legion opened his heart and learned well the sound of your playing. You received the splash plate. I always look a little too excited. All right. Yep. Now you can ride Basque Legion across Tranquility Cove and head to Fire Spit Island. My congratulations to you, Iggy. Belina, do you want to tell her? I mentioned to you before how the previous Lord rescued his Growlithe pup. During that incident, Iskan and Basque Legion saved my life as well. Since then, I've felt a great deal of affection for Iskan here. I truly adore him, but I know there are those who speak ill of me behind my back. So I try to meet with Iskan when there are no prying eyes to preserve his reputation. W well, I was just doing what any decent person would do when I saved you. Perhaps, but nonetheless, after that day, I found this strength to accept Growlithe as he is and not force him to become the next lord. And it was all thanks to the courage you showed me, Iskan. Ah, uh, perhaps we should save this discussion for another time, after all. Raul. I bring good luck to my sisters wherever I go, and ill luck to anyone who crosses our path. I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm. That you spied a four-leaf clover? Well, I'll soon have you sing double. I'm the mill sister, and I'm one clover you can't pick. 
heads I win and tails you lose. You've got no chance in this game of fortune. I'm the youngest coin, but I'm definitely not your good luck piece. We're the Misfortune Sisters, known across the frigid land of Hisui, and your luck's just run out. Now get ready to hand over that Growlithe. You want to take my partner? If your aim is to pester us with bad jokes, those ridiculous introductions of yours were more than enough. Y yes, exactly what she said. Now, Gengar. Oh, hey. Shut up. No. Poor fella. Thanks for the Growlithe, fools! We three can't live the kind of lives we want because of narrow-minded groups like the Diamond Clan and the Pearl Clan. If we want to f live freely in the great land of Hisui, we need to have powerful Pokémon on our side. Don't... Don't worry. We'll make sure this pup grows up nice and strong. We'll e even make him a lord for you. Let's take the mat to our camp and get to work. No one will bother us in a place so miserably hot. You know, we already had a reason to go there. You don't need to add motivation on top. Okay. You insist. What? No, a growl is. Oop. What should we do, Iggy? This is an emergency, right? But, but uh, you see, never, never actually had my partner battle before. Please, Iggy, I beg you, help us. That Growlithe is a very, very dear Pokemon to me. Please save him. They said they were going to a place where nobody would bother them. The only place around the Cobalt Coastlands that seems suitable is Fire Spit Island. Oh, now that you have Basket Legion to help you cross the water, you can reach that island too. Please, could you find in you to help Polina? Yeah, of course. Well, else am I? I was already going there. Oh, thank you, thank you. You're so kind. We will make our way to Fire Spit Island as well. No, Polina. You should wait here and keep little Growlithe safe. I'm sure he needs you right now. Though, I'm not sure if I want to go to an island with the lightning and bandits and... No, come, Iggy. No time to think. We must go now. You should also know the Basque Legion can jump from the water's surface, and then jump once again in the air to go even higher. You can throw items from Basque Legion's back, too. In your case, I guess that would mean throwing Pokeballs to catch Pokemon. Honestly, I have to admit I'm still a little scared. Do you think you could head over first? Yeah, okay. Wait, what do you mean first? Don't you need Basque Legion to get over there, too? Hmm. Okay. Here we go. Oh, he's got a saddle. Neat. All right. Can we jump? Jump. Jump. Neat. All right. Now we can finally get out in the water. Do some exploring. Hmm, anything cool out? Ooh, there's a whole island over here. What's up? What's on here? Looks like a tree and some tumble stones. Okay. Iron chunk. Whatever. Bird you can find elsewhere. Fit this point. Oh, big boy. Oh, that's gone. Hello? No, don't hit me. Ow. I got places to be. What? Oh. Oh. Okay. So then if I just. Yeah, nice. Anything cool on these islands? Uh, not really. Alright, we gotta go around. There's a tentacool. There's some tentacools. Is that a boat? Where'd they get a boat? If I gotta use Basque Legion, why you got a boat? Who gave you that? Up 
up, 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 up we go. Up, 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 up we go. Ooh, Fire Spit Island. It's certainly hot enough to feel like a sweat bath, isn't it? Now we've got a ghost and bandits to deal with on top of the heat. I'm very sorry, but do you think you could lead the way, Iggy? That poor Growlithe. I don't dare imagine what those bandits are doing to him now. I mean... I won't, I won't say if you want them, but, you know, they're training. Oh my god, it's a Magmar. Beat him up. Magmar, Magmar, Gastrodon, Magmar. Uh, let's see with cross poison. Yeah, perfect. Now I can. Him with the great ball. Yes, let's do it. Whoop. Nice. First try. Got it. Wow, good. Lucky that we know exactly where to go. Oh. Well, the wisp during the day. I thought they were just a nighttime thing. Oh, wait. I can't go over this way anyways. Because of the bloody lava. What's up? Ah! Gastrodon, no! No, get away from there! It's spicy! No! Actually, seems okay. I guess because he's a water type. Protects. Nice. Well, there's Magmars is up and down this dying mountain. Well, they're just ripe for the picking as far as I'm concerned. Water pulse. And done. Easy. Grab a little one. It's a little Megby. Cute. Kill him. Listen. Magmar's cool and all, but it's... I've always found it weird that he just has, like, a choker. Just naturally. Bit strange. Bit old. But alright. No. Water pulse. Ooh, just that tiny bit, eh? All right, all right. Just gonna whack you one more. Now we're gonna heal up our Gastrodon. Eh, uh, yeah. Oh wow, I can perfectly use two uh, super potions. How about that? That's pretty fun. Nope, nope, nope. Not that way. Can't do it that way. Because that's not the way to go. Hmm. Yeah, not actually that much of a trek, frankly. Oh, let's get Hunter ready. No, I want, like, poison? No, dark. I'll use Crobat. Hold on. Okay, 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 fine. Let's heal Crobat back up. Get off the bloody thing. 
Here we go. Let's do it. Come on, evolve already. We've done our homework. Any Pokemon gutsy enough to come to this lava trap is supposed to evolve, so get on with it already. You will become stronger, like it or not. Bro, wow. Bro, wow. Oh, look, the pest again. Stand back, sisters. I'll take care of her. Go, Obama Snow. Smash this fool to pieces. Oh, Obama Snow. Okay. Should have had Ponytail out. I'll check Crobat's moves real quick. Battle. Uh, yeah, these are still effective. Ooh, almost. Almost got him with the one shot. Oh, what? Why do you get to go twice? What? That's baloney. All right. Why are you using a snow type? Yeah. Ice type, I guess. What is snow but crunchy ice? Crushed up ice. Battle decided. I don't get it. How'd I lose? You know, Bomba Snow can't fight at full power and crazy heat like this. It was a fair battle. We were basically going easy on you. In fact, how dare you make poor Obama Snow battle in such a stupidly hot place? You're the one who sent out Obama Snow, sister. Go on then, Toxie Crook. Pour out some poison for our unwelcome guest. Sure. She's got jiggle physics on her hair. Battle. Come on now, let me take a swing. Hit you with earth power. Ah, you s son of a butt. Stop. Let me hit you. There we go. See, one shot it as soon as it hit, but. Oh well, whatever. What a blithering mooncap I am. How could I let myself lose? I guess I lose the coin toss sometimes. I did warn you, didn't I, that I had a score to settle with the Galaxy team? All the pain and suffering I experienced after coming up here from the Kanto region to work. I'm going to make you pay for every last slight. Oh, yeah. Yep. Right on. That's it. Honey, I can take on a ride down without no problems whatsoever. Get him with the water moves. Get him with the earth power. One shot. That's all. Gengar. I think I can hit with the ancient power. Wait, stop! Why do they get two moves sometimes? But they're not using Agile style, right? Gotcha. Easy. 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 What a disgrace. Yeah, 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 yeah. How could all of us have been? Hey, Charm. I healed up Obama Snow and Kine's Toxicroak. Good as new. Now we can keep battling until we run out of potions. Oh, jeez. Bow. What? Hey, no one invites you, Tiny. You're really going to insist on getting in the way, you little runt? 
take him down, Toxic Rook. No top, but hang in there, Bomber Snow. Smash that runt. Growlith, please stop. You cannot beat such foes. Polina, what are you doing here? I thought you were waiting with little Growlith. I was, but then he jumped into the ocean without warning and swam all the way here. Into the ocean? But he was terrified of the ocean after it swallowed up the former lord, his own father. But wow. Oh dip. Oh dip dang. It's holy crap. Looks like he finally found his courage. The late Lord's child, he's evolved. His true bravery lay not in crossing the sea, but in finding the strength to face hardship head on. You gotta be joking me. Why the puny one involve? Uh, sisters, something's not right. Uh-oh. That's not good for y'all. Wow! And he's obliterated! Oh no. Oh, jeez. What? Lena, stay back! Aroo! Rah! What was happening to him? A strange lightning hit him. He's become frenzied, just like the other nobles. Ooh, this is exactly why I didn't want to come to this island. Ugh, everything was going just as we'd wanted before that awful much ruined everything. Enough of this, sisters. We leave this place. We won't be making any living without our lives. Hey, wait, this is all your fault! We should get out of here too, Polina. Otherwise, we're fair game for Arcanine. Come on, Iggy, we should hurry. Oh, am I not gonna deal with the frenzied Arcanine? Okay. Lena. What are you going to do about Growlithe? I mean, Arcanine. That there little Pokemon is my responsibility. As his warden, it's my duty to protect him with everything I have. Iggy, what must we do to quell his frenzy? Please tell us what we need. We'll need to make some bombs. Wait, no. We'll need to be, Ah, whatever. Bombs? Arita, what are you talking about? I'm the leader of our clan. Is it so surprising that I know a little more of these things than you, Lena? I held my tongue the first time, but now I must insist. Stop calling me Lena in front of everyone. And yes, I'm well aware you're our leader, Arita. How could I forget that you were the one chosen? You, who can use your Celestica Flute to summon Pokémon and have them carry you to even the farthest reaches of Vastasui. I've learned a little about these frenzies as well. There's a special method for dealing with them. We can make bombs. Pouches contain a mix of the Lord's favorite foods and throw them from a safe distance. Isn't that right, Iggy? Dang, looks like I'm sunburnt as heck. Well, uh, in that case, I do always carry some of Growlithe's favorite foods with me, so I can thank him when he uses his flames to help prepare Basculesion's favorite meal. Why, wow, Iskan, once again your thoughtfulness saves the day. Now we can make those bombs right away. Yes, let's get right to work. I don't think it's called a bomb if it's just food, but okay. Whatever y'all say. They're ready. Here are the bombs we need. Please let me know when you feel prepared to try to quell Lord Arcanine's frenzy. Uh, yeah, I'm ready now. I was ready literally before the cutscenes. Are you ready, Yugi? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go! Okay. Iggy, please do your utmost. He may have finally killed. Yeah, but you're on your guard the late. Yeah, mm, while you're dodging. Yeah, I fucking. This is the fourth time doing this. I know how it works. Stepping through the. Stepping through the spike seat, huh?
Come on, let me do it. Ow. Stop. Whoops. Hit the wrong button. Oh, he has like the same moves as the last one. Yo, what if we made Dark Souls combat, but worse? What do you think of that? Hey, look at this. It's so obvious how it's gonna go out. Come on, just kidding. Yeah. Oh, come on! Dude! I dodged it! I hate how... How loose the animations in this are. I definitely dodged it. Ridiculous, man. Now it's gonna take a million years to load back in. Thank you. What direction you dodge to? It's just a uh, just makes you vulnerable for a bit. Are we good? Are we good? Can I fight him now? There we go. Let's go with Gastrodon, a water type. Yeah. Stop it. I know he's a delicious. Eh, she's a delicious, but it's not a time for this. Yep. That's it, I just had to hit him with the one. Cool. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Oops, a little early, a little early. Yeah, I know, I know. Just be safe, doesn't hit me with the shockwave or whatever. I won't go in the lava. Come on, dude. It's like one left. One tiny notch. Get him, get him, get him. There we go. There we go. Super easy, dude. I only had to fight him once. Tasty. They don't even tell you what their favorite foods are. That's what's. That kind of annoys me, right? They're like, their favorite food. But then it's like, they just say, like, yes, their favorite food, and keep talking about it like that, like it's an variable in an equation and not like a thing that could inform us about their personality. Oh look! The strange light has left RK9 and is vanishing into the space-time rift. Okay. Hmm? Hmm. Yeah. Flame plate. Flame plate! What could possibly lie on the other side of the rift, I wonder? Aru. What? Was that two different Arcanine cries just now? Oh, hey, he's a... He's a guy. Whoa. Whoa! Oh, that's a terribly goofy face. Oh, now I understand. My little Growlithe. Oh no, I misspoke. Lord of the Isles, Arcanine. You and I must now live apart so that we may attend to our separate duties. Now, now, all will be well. You're strong. Far stronger than me, in fact. From now on, let us each strive to fulfill our duties as Lord and Warden. Lord and Warden Dorden. Now go, Lord Arcanine. Your realm awaits. Wait, I thought if you're his Warden, don't you hang out? on his part of the island? Isn't that like part of being, okay, whatever. 
Um, was I the only one who felt like they heard the cry of the previous Lord Orkin? Yeah, oh god. You're just gonna, like, be super blunt about it now? Okay. Oh, how odd. I certainly didn't. But please, I do hope you're joking. I'm easily scared as it is. What am I to do if I start hearing the cries of ghosts all the time? No need to worry, Scan. I only kid. I also heard the voice of the previous Lord calling out to us. It seems I wasn't the only one watching over his young pup this whole time. Iggy, you have my heartfelt thanks for helping my dear little one, the new Lord Arcanine. Sorry to ask even more of you, but please look after Rita as well. Okay. Now then, Scan, I believe we'd best be off. Okay. Iggy. I wasn't much use just watching from the side, was I? You know, when Elena could, wouldn't raise Growlithe to be the new lord and people in our clan were down her fitness as a warden, I urged her to put Growlithe through the proper training, but she snapped at me. This poor Pokemon saw his own father die, she told me. Is the warden's duty to force a child in such pain through that training? Those words left me with much to consider. And even when Arcanine became lord of the isles and grew frenzied, all I could do was watch. Uh, what about the bombs? Please, all I did was arrive later and help explain about the bombs. Something you could have done without me. Is that so praiseworthy? Do I deserve to be recognized for such a sly contribution? I took on leadership of the Pearl Clan so young, with no grand vision for what it should be. Still, I tried to respect our old customs and sights, even as some call me old-fashioned for it. But watching you, I finally see. I know what I want to do. I want to protect this vast land of Hisui. Grant me another battle someday, Iggy. I want to battle alongside my partner so we can grow strong enough to be of help to you and to broaden the horizons of the world I see. Yeah. Looks like I've got Lena to thank for yet another lesson that I've learned. I should let her know and hear more about her relationship with Warden is Scan while I'm at it. Here's where we part for now, Iggy. I need to get off this oven of an island. Yup. All right, let's go report it. And I think that should be about time to end the stream. Yeah. Oh, good. There is a fast travel. Let's talk to Leventin. Five Pokemon. Spiel. The way he just peeks his face into the into the thing. It's adorable. Yep. New observations. Give me more points. Yes. La blub. Splendiferous results. Best report to Captain Selene. Mm, you quelled the new Lord Orcanine. Oh ho, let's tell Commander Kamado the good news then, shall we? Back to Juba life we go. Yep. Here we go. Ba, 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 ba. Hello? Uh, what do you want? Oh, you want some ink, you nasty? Gross. Super gross. I don't want to do that right now. Let's just go Commander Kamado. Commander Tomato. Oh my god, did she get lost again? Oh, we'll deal with that later, too. Commander Kamado, let's do it. Yep, yep, yep. What's up? You did well on your mission in the Cobalt Coastlands. Your efforts there aided not only the Galaxy team, but the Pearl Clan as well. I do hope your efforts will also have an impact on the space time rift somehow. If we are able to get rid of that rift, it should clear any lingering doubts about your origins. Though how we might actually close the rift, I haven't the slightest idea. Remain true to the mission. Nice. Then I'll talk to Celine. Then I'll talk to Celine. Oh, no. Dinner scene. 
you notice that today's potato mochi tastes a bit different? Well, that's because I used a Pokemon's flames to roast them. Bon appetit! The birth of a new Lord Pokemon. What a sight that must have been. If only I had journeyed to Firespit Island to witness the event myself. Could you even ride on Pascal Legion in the first place, Professor? Come now, you know my coordination is so poor I couldn't even hit my own foot with the Pokeball. I can't dodge Pokemon attacks to quite literally save my own skin. Of course, I can't possibly ride atop a fearsome beast like Basque Legion. That being said, we'd all do well to remember these wise words. The ever-striving soul is rewarded in the end, and strive I shall. For the sake of my research, I will surely ride a Pokemon one day and record the experience in our Pokedex for all posterity. Just you watch. The next day. Yep. Let's turn on to the new thing. <gasps> Him. Good morning, good lady who came from the sky. Commander Kamado told me to let you know he awaits your arrival in his office. Yep. This is just gonna cut me there. Or... Yeah. What y'all talking about? Iggy, I have your next orders. You must go to the Coronet Highlands to quell another frenzy noble, Electrode, Lord of the Hollow. Electrode has a, pro a propensity to store up electricity in its body, then unleash it. But since Electrode became frenzied, those electrical outbursts have become giant blasts. Hmm. You'll be enlisting the Pearl Clan's aid in securing your safe passage to Electrode's seat. Send word ahead to Arita asking. And no, you don't have permission to go up the. <sighs> oh, save it. As if I'll be stopped by the likes of you. Now, out of my way! What's up? Hey ho, boss man Kamado. Thought I might have slipped your mind to send me an invite, so I took the liberty of stopping by anyway. Melly, where are your manners? We're having an important conversation. Well, there's your issue right there, Adaman. How exactly did you intend to discuss Electrode without me? It's Mighty Warden here to weigh in. There's no more to discuss. We've already asked Diggy to quell the lore of the Hollow. Oh come on, is it me you're trying to humiliate here, or our entire clan? Besides, do you really think this flimsy little noodle can quell Electrode? Commander, I'm sincerely sorry for this heedless interruption. Pay no mind. It seems even Security Corps personnel I train myself cannot stop one so capable as Warden Melly. That being said... Yes? It is clear that the Security Corps needs even further rounds of training from me later. Hear that, Melly? The Security Corps will sob themselves to sleep tonight thanks to you. The Commander's sumo moves can send even boulders flying. Humph. <laughs> now, now, that will do. Iggy, you have your orders. See to it that Electrode is quelled. Word of Melly, of course we would appreciate your help if there's anything you might assist with. Now go! Okay. Oh, another another cutscene. Listen, Melly, the Galaxy team, well, at least Iggy, is amazing and we'll prove it. Follow me outside. Okay, there we go. I'm going to save. I can remember where. And that'll do it for today, everybody. So thank you very much for tuning in. Whoops, that's the wrong one. There it is. Thanks very much for tuning in at any point or even in the future. Uh, please take the time to follow and subscribe if you haven't. I would appreciate it a great deal. Check out my socials down below, Twitter, uh, YouTube, both personal and stream archive. I have my Discord, which I'm going to be trying to do some more work with coming up. Um, and yeah, uh, anything else? I mean, that does about does it. I'm going to start tomorrow at around noon playing, playing some more of this. So tune in for that. Hope to see you all there. And hey, no one else has told you this. I'll tell you this. You're a good kid. All right, let's see who there is to raid over to tonight. Who is streaming? It is. Hasanabi is the only one I'm seeing. So we're going to... We're gonna go to a rando, haven't done that in a while. 
Uh, let's see, Pokemon. Pokemon Legends Arceus. Who's streaming that right now? Live sh shiny hunting, eh? That is not Arceus. Uh, Jujubee is playing. Scruffy V! Scruffy V looks cute. Let's go with that. Alright. Let him know I sent you. Have a great rest of your Friday. See y'all tomorrow, everybody. Goodbye. Uh, goodbye. Uh, goodbye.